Question four, we've got what appears to be an arithmetic series. It says, um, figure one has got uh, one, two, three, four, five. So we can say five is the first one. The second one has got five, and then we add on another one, two, three, four, plus four, and we get nine in total. And then we're adding on another one, two, three, four on 13. So we've analyzed our series here, and so we're adding on four each time. Okay, so part A says, given that figure N, dot, 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 so this is one, two, three, figure three, figure N, figure N has got 801. Line segments, show that N equals 200. Now it says show, so we cannot use that in our working. We've got to get to that as an answer. So, um, the first in an arithmetic is A. This is A plus D. This is A plus 2D. So this will be A plus N minus 1 times D. So, A is 5, D is 4. A equals 5, D equals 4. This is a little bit more working than you would need. You could just go straight into this and say that first. Implying that... Um, 801 equals 5 plus n minus 1 times 4. So now we have to do the subtraction here. 801 minus 5 is, is 7, 9, 9. And then we def and that's equal to n minus 1 times 4, we do 7, 9, 6, and we can divide by 4. That's very close to 200. It's, um, that's it's equal to n minus 1. 800 divided by 4 is 200, so 7, 9, 6 divided by 4 is going to be 1, 9, 9. And therefore, 200 equals n, and that's our answer. Q, E, D. Okay, so the next part is asking, find the number of line segments in the first 200 figures. So what we want to find is sum 200 equals. Now, we, I'm going to use this formula. Sn equals n over 2 a plus l, first and last. So... There's another way you could do 2a, this one, 2a plus n minus 1 times d. Either works. So, n over 2 is 200 divided by 2, a, which is 5, plus l, which is 801. We just use that. So, s200 equals 100 times... 5 plus 801, which is 806, equals 80600. 